What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2022 Topps Gilded Collection Baseball just sold out. This is a nine box half case break. Picker Teens number one. And you guys, new product release. One pack per box, five cards per pack, one frame gold autograph, and one gold etch chrome autograph per box. So, as you can see, the case is ginormous. So, I'm going to open it up right here. Alright, it looks like. Looks like I got them stacked in. Nine on each side. So, we're gonna gather the bottom nine to stick together. So. Gonna be all one break here. That should make nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Perfect. And then there's nine right here. So if I roll a one, two, three, we're gonna go with the ones on the table. If I roll a four, five, six, we're gonna go with the ones in the box. All right. Let's switch scenes. And let's see which uh, which one we're gonna use here for this one. Roll it to five. So one, two, three for the table, four, five, six for these ones. So these ones over here, I'm gonna move to my left off camera. So obviously you're gonna know that these are part of it. These will be for number two. So again, very nice packaging for, you know, five cards. <laughs> I don't think I got to show you the list, but of course, here's everybody that's in the break. Last ball mojo was Ed. Got the Rockies. I didn't put the star right there, but. There you go, last ball mojo, baby. Alright, here we go. Let's check out some uh, Gilded. Whoa. Almost dropped that. It kind of gives me like a little Luminaries feel of a box, you know? Kind of packaged the same way as Luminaries. Here's your four chrome cards, and here's the one plated card, or frame card, I should say. All right, here we go. So Luke Williams, Corey Seager, and first autograph is going to be Josh Lowe, and this is out of 50, and then Kevin Smith out of 10, the wave. So I think we'll sleeve up every single card here. So Tampa Bay Rays on the board, Mark. This one was out of 10. This one was out of 50. And then the first Luke Williams. Yeah, they're all numbered, so that's perfect. 
Sweet. And there we go. And it's Andre Dawson, 83 out of 99, Montreal Expos edition. It's going to the Washington Nationals, DY. Very good. There you go, man. There you go. And I think all those frames are mainly going to be veterans, too, I believe. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, we are going to top load it. I'm just not going to top load them all right now for the break. The shipping team will top load the rest. But yes, they're all numbered. I didn't realize they're all numbered, so don't worry. They're all going to be top loaded. Uh, Stan Musel. That's number 299. Brandon Marsh. Ooh. Matt Brash. Two autos. How about that? Chas McCormick. You got an extra card here, guys. And a Jose Siri, number to 50. But yeah, I didn't realize they were all numbered, so that's kind of funny. But yeah, they're all going to be top loaders. All right, so Houston Astros, Ed. Then Seattle Mariners, that's Matt Smith. And that Stan Muse was actually really nice. I wonder how these are going to go, or how much these are we going to sell for. They look really sharp. Is there a way to get a third hit? Ted Simmons to 99 for the Cardinals. Matt Olson, number to 99. Chipper Jones, Corbin Burns, Peyton Henry, number to 25. So Marlins, Robert Runkle, Brewers, Lewis, Chipper Jones, Atlanta Braves, Rob, and then Matt Olson, another one for the Braves, Rob. It is Bird Blylevin to 10. Tim Anderson, Tyler Gilbert, and a Byron Buxton. It's pretty sweet. Autograph. And again, that's number to 85. Minnesota Twins, that's Pat Wolf. And of course, the Gilbert's number to 99. And then the Tim Anderson, also number to 99. And the last hit here is little Randy Rosarino. Number to 25. All right, autograph now, frame. Frank Thomas, the big hurt to 25. 
Very nice one there for the White Sox. Going ahead. All right, pretty much halfway through with this box here. Del Bruhan, Riggy Anderson, and ooh, we got a redemption. It looks like there's going to be two extra cards here. Ivan Castillo Auto, which is number to 25. Then a Ronald Acuna Jr., number to 10, 4 of 10. Nice to be Del Bruhan there, too. Let's block that. And we got Ricky Henderson there. Yeah, I was going to say, I think Julio's a redemption. I don't know about Wander, but it's probably going to be one of those two guys, right? Julio Rodriguez. Yep. Tops Gold Etch Autograph. Seattle Mariners, Matt Smith. Congratulations, man. Nice. Nice Julio there. And uh, let's... Alan Trammell to 99. Detroit Tigers. So we got an extra auto. So it looks like some boxes are giving you guys extra autos, which is great, right? I mean, we'll take them. Pedro Martinez, George Springer, Hunter Green, number to 199. And it looks like we have a, another redemption. And it looks like it says Topps Chrome Gold Etch Autograph Rose Gold Etch. Which Rose Gold Etch is probably like the Ivan Castile maybe out of 25. And it's Bryce Harper. Bryce Harper, very nice for the Phillies. Going to D low. That's right, baby. Go birds, baby. And then we also got another auto. Mark Canha. Out of 50 for the Mets. Mets is going to add. And we got an Edgar Martinez to 25 frame for the Mariners. Going to Matt Smith. Well, I'm not a Phillies fan, but I like the Eagles. I grew up here in LA with no football team, so. So, uh, I cheer for the Eagles. Fell in love with them in the early 2000s with McNabb at 2001. But, I mean, I don't have no hate for the Phillies, honestly. But D'Lo, of course, our customer, is a big Philly guy. <laughs> I'm sure there was a lot of Eagles fans that just started rooting for the Eagles this week. <laughs> All right, Bryce Harper. Tyler Gilbert. And Austin Meadows. With a Spencer Torkelson. That's a very nice card right there.
You know what's funny about that, Adam, is that uh, I, I'll, I'll never be able to be a Jets. I'll never be able to root for the Jets because I don't know if I'll ever see them in the Super Bowl. I can never become a fan of theirs. Uh, any Rays or Angels yet? Yes! We've had some Rays, just no Wander yet. Tyler Gilbert. And Goose Gossage at a 5 for the Yankees. That's Matt Smith. <laughs> I'm just kidding, man. I actually really like your Jets team, Adam. I think they're a lot more promising now that they haven't been in a while, right? You got a solid cornerback again that's going to probably dominate the league for 8 to 10 years, maybe. I don't know how long the lifespan is for cornerbacks, but figure like Darrell Rivas, you know? Um, you know, you got some good offensive weapons. I think just the quarterback is kind of just the only question mark now. Well, I mean, you, it's New York, man. I mean, as, as long as the New York teams do good, you're always going to get bandwagon fans. And your fans will continue to grow. Wade Box. Randy Johnson. Pete Alonzo, speaking of uh, New York teams. Ed with that one. Yogi Berra. Number to 10. 4 of 10. That's a sweet card right there. Well, now that Tom Brady is out, what are what are all these teams going to do about the quarterback position, man? Tom Brady was linked to, like, three different teams, right? Tampa Bay, Vegas, San Francisco, maybe. Now, now what are those teams going to do? And that Pete Alonso is number 50. Well, see, that's the thing, Tez. Yeah, this, this now... I just think it's so funny. The, the minute Purdy, like, got injured and... And, uh, you know, they announced his injury. So many people started, like, not buying his cards anymore. So I think they realized, all right, the fairy tale, the fairy tale season is over. Right? Now it's like, I think 49er fans would love to give Trey Lance another chance because, obviously, he's much more talented. Bill Mazeroski to 25 for the Pirates, going to Matt Smith. But, yeah, there's, there's a lot more competition, though, I will say. You know, Rodgers might potentially get traded. Derek Carr is definitely getting traded. You know, there'll be a couple free agent quarterbacks that, you know, potentially can, can be a starter for like a bridge year or two. Garoppolo will be an option as well. I don't think they bring back Garoppolo at all. I think they're going to roll with Purdy and Trey Lance. You got two young quarterbacks there on rookie deal still. You don't have to pay them much. And you can see how it works out for one of those two in the next like two years and then pay one of those guys if they pan out. If not, you just restart from scratch. All right, guys, last box here. Derek Jeter, number 299, Ryan Velotti, Max Muncy, and a Gavin Sheets, 250. Dodgers with that one, that's Rob. Oh, that's right, I totally forgot about Lamar. He's the only one I think that will be definitely have a chance to sign somewhere else. I think Kyler's kind of locked down in Arizona. He did sign that big, massive deal. Unless they trade him, but I don't think so. I think whoever, you know, ends up coaching there, I don't even know if they have their coach here or not, but I think he'll, I think he'll stay in Arizona. I don't think he'll go anywhere. Tannehill might get a job somewhere else, but I don't really know how much impact he's going to make on our new team, honestly. And Trevor Hoffman in 99 for the Padres. All right, and there you go. I think Lamar's going to get franchise tag for sure, yeah. I think they even announced that they will. All right, guys, well, there you go. That was the first nine. 
So again, second half is in the store. It might be sold out already, might not. I'm not sure, but it was down to three left the last time I checked. So appreciate it, guys. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Let's get number two going. <laughs> 